All right, if you don't have a car with a Bluetooth radio, you may be thinking about ways to get your car ready for the upcoming hands-free driving law. And that law takes effect July 1st. The law says drivers may not handle their phones at all when they're behind the wheel. In our 13 WMAZ poll, we want to know if you will convert your car for hands-free driving. You can answer yes or no. Open the 13 WMAZ app or go to 13WMAZ.com slash vote. Wanye Reese took a closer look at options to help you get ready so you don't get caught breaking that law. Audio Zoo manager Pete Unwin said they have been seeing an increase in business from people ditching their old radios. With that law coming out, it's become more prominent for people to want to change the radios. The reason is because of the hands-free driving law, which starts in July. Under the law, you will not be able to hold your cell phone to your ear or hold it in your hand when driving. Unwin says AudioZoo has 18 wireless options that can connect to your phone from high tech to basic. The common ones that we sell, um, CD, USB, auxiliary, if they wanted to plug the phone in to charge it. And of course, it comes with the Bluetooth for the purpose of phone calls. At this point, you may be asking yourself, how much does this all cost? According to Unwin, his Bluetooth radios range from $89 for the most basic option to more than $500 for fancier models. Now, if you're not interested in getting a new radio installed in your car, you can get a cheaper option like this suction cup right here for as low as $15, or you can get a fancier option. But this one in my hand, it's only 25 bucks. We also took a look at the options at Best Buy. Trey Rooney said that there are a lot of suction cup options, including a CD slot phone holster. So, I mean, you probably don't have to have your phone mounted at all times anyway. Throw this in the, you know, the dash, have it ready for you to use in the CD slot. Best Buy's options range from $20 on the cheaper end and $100 for an option that's a little fancier. But all those options are aimed at making sure you don't get pulled over in July for being on your phone. And making Wanye Reese, 13 WMAZ News. All right, we wanted to know will you convert your car for hands-free driving? Our 13 WMAZ poll results show that 64% well, of you say you're not planning on it right now.